Welcome to Cyber Talk, where we talk about the life and how it is to be a cyber backer working from home. Cyber Talk is powered by Cyberbacker, the leading provider of world class admin support services from anywhere in the world to anyone in the world. Please visit our website www.cyberbacker.ph for more details. Okay, another awesome week here at Cyberbacker. My name is Jello. I'm your host, and we are back with another episode of Cyber Talk. And of course, we have a very special guest on the show right now. Dan, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, Jello. Thank you very much for asking. It's a pleasure to be here. Yes, we're very excited to get this interview with you. So great, great. let's get the show on the road. Now, to let you know, we have a lot of listeners who are cyberbackers and a lot of Filipinos who would want to be a part of Cyberbacker too. So let me help me out here. Um, can you introduce yourself to our audience? Maybe starting off with what is your role here in Cyberbacker, Dan? Okay, great, great. Well, my name is Daniel, Daniel Lorenzana, and uh, most of the guys call me Tito Dan. Well, obviously, you could see, right? <laughs> I am the director for applicant or for applicant experience for the elite team. So that means that I am responsible for the experience of everybody who's coming in for their final interviews. So basically, you talk to a lot of people then too, right? Oh gosh, we talk to a lot of people. We get, <laughs> it gives us a kick. Yeah, it really gives us a thrill to be able to be the people responsible in getting them into the family because uh, for those who don't know i mean your final interview is the last leg of the interview process so it's it's really quite a thrill to be able to have the opportunity to you know Mm -hmm. welcome the new cyber backers on board (laughs) yes and of course telling them about your experiences here too because of course many of them i assume are (laughs) listening to us right now so how long have you been with cyber backer dan not too long jello i've been with the company for 14 months. 14 months. Yeah, if I'm counting months. the I've come 14 or 15, I started late October of 2020. Okay. So um, I'm curious to know, before you became a part of the Cyberbacker family, what were you doing? I had a very good career in the hospitality industry, Jello. I started out as a waiter for the fast food chains. Mm-hmm. I had the opportunity to move up way up the ladder i got the opportunity to open three five-star hotels as part of food and beverage team i worked food and beverage operations for the airlines for the cruising industry i had a brief stint with uh, training people to be ready to work on board cruise ships it was a fantastic career that uh, brought me places i went uh, to several countries the u.s uh, all over asia and i had the experience of traveling all over the Philippines, Luzon, besides Mindanao. Wow. It was a great career. I spent almost 30 years there. That journey from being a dishwasher for Jollibee to being a director for food and beverage on some of the five-star hotels around and opening several bars and restaurants all over the metro and even in the countryside. That journey took me 30 years. Gosh, man, literally... <laughs> You've been around. You've been. I've been around. around. I've been around. Gosh, Land, sea, and air, Jello. Wow, Land, sea, and air. Wow, yep. man. Mm-hmm. God, traveling. Man, would love to be able to do that sometime. Maybe after the pandemic. Who knows, right? Yeah, who knows? I I miss doing it, Jello. Actually, yeah. <laughs> a lot of restrictions, but you never know. Hopefully, the pandemic ends real, real soon for us to be able to get back to that. Right? Yeah. Now and talking talking about the pandemic, it was it was the catalyst. I mean, yeah. nobody was able to forecast that. True. Nobody was able to predict that. And I'm sure a lot of you guys know what happened to the restaurant, the hospitality industry yeah. when the pandemic hit. It virtually died. Yeah. And I died along with it, actually. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, there's always something positive that oh, comes yes. out of any negative, right? Yes, yes. Most, now most you're, definitely. <laughs> now you're a part of Cyberbacker. Yeah, right? Cyberbacker yes. was the biggest thing that happened to me over the over that period, Jello. I mean, I could not even begin to imagine how I would end up to be right now if I didn't meet Cyberbacker. If I was not able to see the opportunity that Cyberbacker offers... I don't know where I'll be right now. Endless opportunities. Actually. Endless Actually. opportunities here mm-hmm. in Cyberbacker. True. Amen to that. Now, um, I'd like to know, 
Have you always seen the value of working virtually? Just something like this. What we're you know, doing now. That's funny, Jello, because before I knew Cyberbacker, I didn't even know that you could actually work virtually. <laughs> <laughs> Same, here. Same here. I didn't even, I had no idea that there was an entire career out there that you could do from home. Because I was so engrossed in what I was doing. I had no, I, I really didn't have any idea what's happening outside of that industry. But now but, here we are. But working, now here, yeah, <laughs> and loving it, if I may ask. Yes, here we go, <laughs> loving it. Mm -hmm. Same here, same feelings mm -hmm. about that. Now, what made you decide to join Cyberbacker? And where did you hear about Cyberbacker? Actually, I heard it from a friend. It was desperate times, nearly, nearly broke jobless and i'm no spring chicken you know and uh, <laughs> it's not that easy already to to find a job and then one of my uh, friends of my daughter actually said hey tito i'm working virtually and i go like what okay what the heck is that okay we're looking for somebody to do interviews maybe you want to give it a try i said okay i'll give it a try go ahead what do i do you know he had to literally walk me through it how to apply to cyberbacker for idiots <laughs> he had to walk me step by step by agonizing step what to do in order to log in, send in the application form, you know, and this is the link for the assessments and everything. He walked me through the entire thing. And that's how it turned out. <laughs> but there again, now you're a part of Cyberbacker mm -hmm. team. And mm -hmm. now imagine you are welcoming the new Cyberbacker exactly. to the family. Who exactly. would have ever thought, right? Who would have ever thought? Who would have thought of that? <laughs> I mean, not in my wildest dreams, Jello, not in my wildest dreams. Now, of course, you also went through the process of getting interviewed, yes. of course, first yes. parts of being part of Cyberbacker. So what were your initial expectations? What were your first impressions about Cyberbacker then? Well, like I said, Jello, I had no idea what Cyberbacker was. And uh, my, my personal feeling at that time is I was scared out of my pants, really, because it's something that I had no idea about. I didn't know what the company was all about. And I was, I was too excited to ask. When they said, here's a job, here's the link. Okay, I'll jump into it. What do I do? You know, I, I didn't ask anything. And then I went through the interview. The interview was so, so pleasant. You know, it, it was like more of a conversation. And I will never forget that. Actually, that's the experience I try to impart to the people that I interview. You know, you don't have to be afraid. You have to be natural, you know, because when, when you relax and you talk naturally. The real um, you comes out, right? The real you comes out. Yeah, the real you comes yeah. out. Yeah, the real you comes out. Now, I'm also curious. You've been with Cyberbacker for, as what you mentioned, 14 months. 14 months, yeah. What <laughs> made you stay where you are right now? God, a lot of things. I mean, the opportunity of meeting a lot of people, you know, and uh, being part of their, well, sending them off actually on their cyber backer journey. Yeah. Not just being part of it. That's one amazing thing. And the other thing is, mm -hmm. I mean, the team that I work with, I mean, the career team is one of the most dynamic group of people that I have ever worked with. Not to mention, the, the, the when I say the career team, everybody who's there, everybody who's supporting, the leadership structure that we have, you know, like you said, I've been around. I've met two CEOs over my entire mm -hmm. career, but I have never had a personal relationship, a friendship with a CEO. I didn't even have an area director, you know, who knows that I have grandkids. But to think that the, my family's picture is hanging up there in the wall in the office back in Utah, you know, that that blows me away. And uh, Craig, Sheila, they're fantastic people. I mean, just being able to work with them and being able to share the experience of being a cyberbacker with them. I mean, I have a confession to make. When I when I sure. first came into cyberbacker, I said, "Oh, this is gonna be a job. This is gonna be a paycheck until everything opens up again." You know. But right wow. now, I don't see myself doing anything else. I mean, this could be my retirement. Who knows? As long as I am able to contribute to the company, as long as uh, Greg Sheila wants to keep me around, I think I'll be here till I'm 70. <laughs> <laughs> Again, this is, a, this is a career, right? This is yes, where you yes. build the career, of course. Exactly. Cyberbacker. Exactly. Now, now, I want to talk more about your daily routine. So what does your day look like, Dan? Can you give me a, like a brief overview of what it looks like? Not, not, don't need to, it to be very specific, but just a, a brief well, overview. Well, yeah. Well, my, my shift starts at uh, 9 o'clock Manila time. So I get out of bed at 8.45. No, joking. 
15 minutes. I try to be out my, at my workstation about 15 minutes early, you know, chit chat with the rest of the team. I look at the schedule for the day. Who, how many interviews do I have lined up? Who do I have lined up? And then uh, after I do that, uh, 45 minutes into my shift, checking, clearing all of my emails. Interviews start and interviews, interviews, interviews for the next six, seven hours, you know, talking to people from all over the country. Sometimes people uh, applying to be cyber backers from abroad. Wow. You know? We've had Jamaican applicants, uh, South African applicants, uh, applicants from Nigeria, from uh, Pakistan, wow. from, from everywhere. So it, it feels like I'm doing, I'm doing a global tour every day. It really <laughs> Almost the same as what you were doing before. Yeah. Something like yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. So it's basically interviews. And then, if, of course, there will be days that you have to attend meetings. There will be days that you have to attend to activities. You know, basically, that's it. Most of these interviews. And then you do your reports, end of day reports. At the end of the day, I touch base with my uh, boss, uh, M. Rodriguez, an amazing person, an amazing human being. And uh, after that, then we call it a day. You know, you need to, time to refresh yourself and then looking forward to 15 next minutes day. before. Yeah, looking forward <laughs> to the next day. They are very yeah. exciting. But again, <laughs> really talking to a lot of people, really all, all, from all walks of life. Too. All walks of life, Jello. You want to believe it. All walks of life. <clears throat> now, my next question is, again, still about your experience here in Cyberbacker. So how did Cyberbacker change your life, Dan? Share with you another secret, Jello. Sure. Working, <laughs> working for 30 years. In the hotel industry, never really got that much in my savings account. Savings. Okay. Up until Cyberbacker came along during the end of my first year, I go like, what? Gosh, right? <laughs> what? I have, a, I have a six-digit saving account? That never freaking happened. <laughs> <laughs> that never happened ever in my 30 years, you know? I mean, you, you make a little bit more, you spend a little bit more. So I was a very good contributor to the Philippine economy because money would just pass through me, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but now but you got a those year savings. in cyberbacker. I was I was thinking of that first Christmas, you know. That is when you start opening up. Oh, yeah, how much do I have in the bank? How, what kind of presents do I get to give out? You know, and I take a look. I go, what? <laughs> Unreal. What? How the <laughs> how the crap did that happen? So, I mean, that's one one way that uh, Cyberbacker changed my life. And having more time, I never thought leisure activities was totally alien to me. But now I go on bike rides. Yeah, I go on uh, on weekends. I, I get, go on camping trips. You know, I was able to get a secondhand car, which was secondhand as it may seem, but uh, still a car though. It's still a car still though. A car, I though. mean, yeah, yeah. And uh, in, in my entire career, that's only the third car that I got, and I don't even need it. I just use it for you know going out point to a camping to point trips. B. Point A to <laughs> point, point, a, B. point B. Yeah. I still use my motorcycle. Still use my motorbike. But uh, yeah, to have that car and being able to you know. Go around with the kids, you know, safely, if I may add, safely, yes. not piggybacking on my uh, motorbike, which is uh, quite irresponsible for a kid. But <laughs> <laughs> they're imagine ah, just a year with cyber. It's amazing. Just a year. In a year, Jello, in a year, God. in a year. And, and uh, we are, we are very excited to see, of course, where this could be potentially in the next few more months for you and for Cyberbacker, of course. Now, um, Dan, mm -hmm. of course, in every journey, there are people that would be helping us. There are people that you would meet a along lot. the road. So a lot. this is the part of the interview where we give you the chance to say thank you to the people that you would like to thank. So are there any mm -hmm. people that you would like to give special shout outs to or thank yous on the show? Mike, oh, my you. God. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. First, to our two leaders, I mean, Sheila and Craig, two incredibly amazing people. I mean, just company president, the company CEO who lives you know, halfway across the world, you know, yeah. but I get to call them, apart from calling them boss, I get to call them my friends. True. You know? Friends. I mean, I'd like to give them a huge shout out. Uh, thank you for leading the company and uh, thank you for the opportunity to, that you give to everybody else. And of course, I mean, to my idol, I mean, to, to the person that I'd like to emulate, emulate would be a key already to who <laughs> he is, M. Rodriguez. I mean, was M. Memsh, 
I mean, go. yeah, ma'am, sure, you are an incredible human being. I love you to bits. I mean, I wouldn't be here where I am if I don't get the push that I get from ma'am. If I don't get that direction that I get from Memsh, just knowing that he's there, you know, he's there. He he lets you know where to go, what there, what goals to hit. Just make sure that uh, we do hit that goal. A huge thank you to M. Rodriguez and to everybody, everybody in the career team. I mean, I've worked with, uh, over the year, I've worked with all of them very closely. I mean, career backers, Gurley, uh, Abby, Tony, Kervin, Lester. I mean, there's so many of them. Uh, if I could, don't name you one by one, guys, you, you know who you are. The career consultants, I mean, uh, I, I was part of uh, leading them for a while. They are incredible people. They they work like crazy every day. Well, to all of the cyberbacks out there that I got to interview, I mean, there's maybe a gazillion gazillion of you out there. Thank you. I mean, the experience of being able to welcome you into the family, it's part of the gas. It's part of the fuel that ignites my fire to, you know, con- to continue to do what I do. Just knowing that uh, you're there, you're cyberbackers right now, you're working, you know, it's just such a fulfillment for me. And I'd like to thank each and every single one of you. If you're listening to me right now, I'd like to thank you for giving me the opportunity to be part of your journey. We are very excited, of course. We are very, very excited for more things for me, more career growth, more savings, and more time with the family. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much for that, Jello. Looking forward to that as well. It's going to be like a, well, we're looking at a huge, huge growth over the next uh, few months. And uh, yeah, we are the career team. We're looking for more and more people. We're looking at, you know, being able to get, would you believe this, Jello, 25,000 applications yes, 25. a week. 25. So for all the cyber backers out there, grow your profit share trees. Start recommending people. I mean, we're waiting for them. We need 25,000 of them every week, guys. Come on, help us out. <laughs> and we're ready for them anyway, right? We're yeah, ready, we're for, ready them. for them. We're ready for them. Just the face that the, they will come. They will come and we're ready for them. Of course, we are ready for everyone who would be wa- who wants mm-hmm. to be a part of Cyberbacker. And of course, to all of our listeners, if you'd like to be a part of Cyberbacker and meet Dan eventually during the process, please yeah. visit our website www.cyberbacker.ph and our social media pages on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Dan, it was a pleasure meeting you oh, today and speaking with you. I hope we can was, do this again sometime. It was my pleasure, Jello. It was my pleasure. <laughs> thank you very much day, for having man. me. Yeah, thank you. You too as well. Stay safe out there, everyone. Thank you to all the listeners of CyberTalk. If you enjoyed our podcast, don't forget to watch out for our upcoming episodes. We're going to dish them out weekly. Do visit our official website, www.cyberbacker.ph and don't forget to like Cyberbacker on Facebook and Instagram. Once again, this is your host, the one, the only. My name is Jello. Always remember, make life bigger with Cyberbacker. Till next time. <laughs>